Welcome to the uh, Memphis Urban League Second Annual Conference, United to Lead. Uh, tell us your name. Brandy Richard. Unite to Lead. What does that mean to you? I think it's important in order for us to change our communities that we have the largest number of people at the table to be able to successfully do that. Grassroots initiatives and movements, which is what the Urban League is supposed to be, take people. And they take people that can overcome differences and, and work together to push something forward. And so the theme of this conference, I think, is very, very important um, to ensuring that we keep that in mind, we keep that at top of mind, so that we can really see some changes. Brandy, uh, she was the keynote, mm -hmm. and how did you enjoy her speech, and, and what did you take away from it uh, as a young professional, and as an entrepreneur, what did you take away from it? I took from it that you should never stop, and just keep on doing what you're doing, and understand that you have to, um, lead, have to lead, but you also have to be able to follow. Brandy is phenomenal. What I love most is she is able to see the different perspectives and angles, and she's able to see the generation before us, as well as the millennials. So she's able to add insight and her key message that she hit on was right on point for the young professionals of our community and I feel like the Urban League young professionals all over the nation as she is the national president. How has it been thus far in terms of meeting different people, networking, uh, there are a lot of people from around the country here and how's that engagement been for you thus far? So far it's been great. I've met uh, different people. I've um, sat on the panel, um, I sat and listened to the panel for the senior ground. I've learned a large amount of information from them. It was a great panel discussion. The uh, national president is on the panel for Andy. She has a lot of things to say. What has been your favorite part of the conference thus far? I like the breakout sessions. The breakout sessions, you you get to hear a lot of the opinions from different people from different backgrounds or different walks of life. And uh, you get different views on certain aspects of the things that's going on. And I think learning different views, strengthening your own views is vital for young professionals and just connecting with other people based off of the breakout sessions that we're having. I think it's, they're pr pretty influential. The theme of the conference is the Unite to Lead. As a leader yourself, what piece of advice would you give up and coming young professionals as they go out into their communities and they want to become leaders and uh, doers and action takers in their, in their communities and organizations? Don't ask someone. Don't ask for permission to lead. Don't ask for permission to lead an initiative. Don't ask for permission to participate and, and join forces. Don't believe that the leaders of the organization are all-knowing and all-powerful and that you can't contribute because there's a, there's a place for you and it's beyond tweeting and hashtagging and social media. There's an actual need for your services and communities. And so we, we need you. So don't, don't be apologetic about going out and, and doing what it is you know to do.